Yeah, 15 minutes it is with studied as in Harvard Graduate School of Design, but I think it got popularized by the Lady Mayor of Paris during the pandemic. So they are now revitalizing, renewing, redeveloping Paris, 15 minute city. And 15 minute city is all your origin destinations within 15 minutes, uh, walking, biking, and public transit, mass transit. Evaluate, assess our cities like employees of Magadi Central Business District, they spend about three to five hours just coming to work. So Makati is not, or Metro Manila for that matter, is not a 15 minute city, 15 minutes. Sort of threshold or sort of uh, ideal city, 15 minute cities, five minute neighborhoods, 10 minute communities. Yeah, one is, uh, it's also healthy cities because for us adults, we, sh we must walk 10,000 steps a day to stay healthy. That's about seven kilometers. When I'm abroad, we, I walk even in Manhattan or Europe, even Dubai, more than 10,000 steps a day because it's so convenient as pedestrian and the mass transit. And there's connectivity from mode of uh, one mode of transportation to the other. And there are 32 modes of transportation and 18 kinds of infrastructure, which is lacking here. We don't have the connectivity. Even coming from the airport, nobody picks you up in the airport. Sometimes more than uh, one hour to wait for a taxi. And at Palafox, we have uh, overarching guidelines, but as much practicable, we must plan and design environment-friendly cities, communities, and buildings that are smart, sustainable, resilient, livable, walkable, bikeable with mass transit, public transit, uh, safer, better lighted, healthier, hopefully happier. Uh, Cross-generational mixed income, integrating places to live, work, shop, dine, learn, and worship with healthcare and wellness centers and recreation with some 24-hour cycle activity centers. I've been saying we need 100 new cities by 2050 because of our increasing population. Otherwise, existing cities will become as bad, if not worse, than Metro Manila. So in those new townships, new cities, we should have housing for the human capital employees uh, like makati central business district uh, the employees of makati are priced out of the housing stock of makati that's why they spend three to six hours a day just commuting and planning is balanced it should be balanced in terms of land use income cross-generational mixed income that's a healthy balanced city we are uh, advocating more compact cities and more vertical cities because urban sprawl is not efficient. Urban sprawl, you encroach into the forest and to the farms. You allocate to yourself prime, limited urban land resources instead of more compact, higher density development. Like I was invited to speak in, in Rome, remaking of Mumbai in India. In the recommendation, I think they're implementing now. I think 1,000 buildings in Mumbai that was deteriorating they will be demolished and put up high-rise buildings like Singapore. India, I think, is their democracy is as chaotic as ours. And everything we do at Palavox, I've been telling my people here, like even projects we do, we should visit them. And I give you a big eraser and how we could have done better if we do it again. I'd rather see my mistakes on paper than see it in concrete. And when better is doable, good is not good enough.